Hi, welcome to Siemens NX12 video tutorial. It's an improvement to the wings of the WW109 fighter plane. You should really watch it, because I didn't show you this solution, because I've missed an option. It was hidden. And I went back to that tool, the bridge surface, and now I saw it. Okay, so you could do as I did in the uh, wings video up to this point and now I want to use a swept. I, I've shown you that swept already but I didn't show you the bridge surface. So let's go for a swept. Select those two arcs because stop at intersection single curve. Go there, same procedure here. Make sure those arrows point in the same direction or in the correct direction, sorry, the other way around. And select this as guide, go for linear arc length fixed constant and OK. Now let's hide the sketches. That would be this sketch here. And of course that sketch. Now I want to sew those two surfaces. And then I want to go for the bridge. So go for that bridge here. Select this edge and that edge. Which gives you a nice sort of surface, almost a full surface. And you can control the tangent magnitude. And the last time I took a look at that feature, I didn't notice that. I missed it. So let's open this up. That offset, this one here, at edge 2 should be 0. Otherwise it will go below that edge here. So make this one 0. And now I can change the tangent magnitude here of edge 2, maybe like this, which gives me a really nice surface here. And apply. Then turn it around, go for the other side, which should work as well. Yeah. Zoom in. And let's use this edge and of course that edge. Again, the second edge offset should be Zero, it's zero, that's okay. The other one should be zero as well. And that was an accident, so go back to the bridge surface. And I want to change that tangency, the tension here. This should be, oh, that's the wrong one. That's interesting. So that would be this one, okay? Take a look from the side. Let's give it a little bit more magnitude. Yeah, that's okay, and confirm. And now I have a really nice surface here. Then proceed as I did in the other video. Just sew those three surfaces, the one down below as well. That would be this one. And OK. And then extend that sheet up to the main sketch plane and then move it five degrees upwards. So let's go for trim sheet extend sheet. There it is. Select that edge here. The face up to it should go, would be the main sketch plane. And OK. And then tilt it five degrees upwards around that axis here. Same 
as before so go for menu edit move object I want to rotate it around an angle yes this surface here the vector would be this one and the angle should be in that direction so let's move this and that would be 355 degrees and okay and I'm done and I'm done so hope this was helpful hope you enjoyed it if you did like it please give it a like or leave a comment if you want to see more please give it a like or leave a comment please subscribe to my youtube channel please subscribe to my facebook fm page would be very nice of you i want to get more likes and subscriptions over there as well thanks for watching see you to the next one bye bye